What's up, YouTube? This is Scott Seuss from back another video, and today we're going to be doing a uh, review on the Rust Oleum truck bed coating. I use this for almost every build I do myself, and literally all my customers want something right on line, whether it be the frame or, or bed line, whether it be the frame or their beds. And we are doing the, uh, we are right on the Apache. So it's going to be that versus this Iron Armor truck bed coating. So basically, in short, long story short, this is the Rust-Oleum bed liner. You can see, and I, I'm, I'm dabbing every inch of this on with a brush. I prefer to do it by hand. I have a sprayer, but I don't like using it. Plus, it's raining outside. So we have a little bit of texture here with the Rust-Oleum. It's dabbed on with a brush, like I said. So this is the Rust-Oleum. And then we have Rust-Oleum here. And then we have this Iron Armor. I just put it on there but look how thick it is and look how much better texture you get out of this so rustoleum texture here and then iron armor here so it's been open for about i don't know three minutes now you can see here it's thick which is nice i guess look at that it's thick and creamy when we lay it on here, you can see a huge difference in the, you know, when you lay the bed liner, you want to get that bumpy effect. And this definitely does a better bumpy effect for you than the Rust-Oleum. I mean, you can just see it poking out there. And you don't need much, I mean, I just got a little dab of it right there. Not even covering my brush. It's laying thick and also it's drying really quick. I mean it's a little it's a little warm today. But Rust Oleum does not dry this quick. And this I think might be a better quality. If you're going to run on stuff, whether it be your whole entire truck or bed line stuff, the cheap way, whether it be your entire truck or it be your bed, your frame, whatever you're doing. But anyways, it definitely gives you a better textured effect than the Rust-Oleum does. Of course, it's not dry yet completely, but I mean, it's, it's definitely drying a lot faster than Rust-Oleum does. And uh, I think that... Uh, I'm going to start picking this iron armor over that Rust-Oleum from now on. They're about the same price I got this on Harbor Freight, but it definitely gives me a better presentation and look that I'm going for versus the Rust-Oleum here. Now, I don't know why I'm running on my Apache. It just has all brand new metal on it, brand new cap corners, brand new flooring. I do have one small hole here. And then one small hole here. I don't care. It's a chop top rat rod. But um, I just want to do a video on this truck bed coating. So if you guys want to use truck bed coating and you want the actual, you know, pokey effect and a better quality, go with Iron Armor. Don't go with Rust-Oleum. Thanks for watching.